Prime Minister Ying Luck's visit to Cambodia was you know, hyped with the very high expectations in the beginning. Yes. So she made it, and I'm trying to find out specifically what she got from Hun Sen, apart from the nice pictures of uh, Kun Ying Luck accompanied by her husband. And yes, um, mm -hmm. I think she, the first time that she is accompanied by her husband outside of the country. Yes. And then Hun Sen also was accompanied by his wife. His wife, yes. And that was a nice picture of yes. friendship, handshakes, but, you know, in substance, what did she get? Well, like you say, Kun Sui Chai, there's a lot of exchange of niceties <laughs> yeah. that, uh, coming uh -huh. up from the meeting. But um, uh, Kun Yik Lak went to Cambodia, uh, people expect two things to mm -hmm. to be achieved mm -hmm. by her. The first thing is the release of Kun uh, Wira and Kun La Tri, mm -hmm. the two Thai activists. Mm -hmm. uh, she didn't get that. No? No. Um, and today you can see the confusion of the Thai media mm -hmm. uh, concerning the fate of Kun Ying Lak, uh, oh, sorry, uh, of Kun Wira and Kun La Tri. Mm -hmm. Some say that, okay, they are set to be released mm -hmm. anytime soon. Some, mm -hmm. some newspapers said that Hun Sen accepted her request mm -hmm. to help the two. Mm -hmm. But uh, we have looked into the wording of the senior Cambodian officials mm -hmm. and nothing seemed to be changing at all. No. No. Uh, Ho Nam Hong, the Deputy Prime Minister, also said the same thing that Cambodia has been saying all along that uh, Kun Vila and Kun La Tri has to serve mm -hmm. two thirds of their sentence first. Mm -hmm. But uh, didn't he say that Hun Sen would try to shorten the jail term? <laughs> well, um, he said two things at the same time. Hon Nam Hong said, uh, Kun, Hun Sen, uh -huh. uh, Prime Minister Hun Sen will help shorten the jail term. Yeah. And in the same sentence, Hon Nam Hong said that Kun Vila and Kun La Tri, whatever happened, they will have to serve two thirds first. Uh, uh -huh. Maybe after. Well, two thirds of the shortened jail term, maybe. <laughs> um, from my understanding, uh -huh. uh, Hon Nam Hong was saying that. Uh, after having served two thirds of the sentence, mm -hmm. and then the jail term can be shortened. <laughs> well, so, yeah, no. uh, yes. Uh -huh. um, okay. up, up to but I was more interested in the Kaupari Han case. Did uh, Ying Lak get anything from Hun Sen in terms of any concession, any new hopes of joint cooperation? Well, um, we, we, we have a taken a look into what the people, uh, senior officials of two countries said today. Mm -hmm. and. Mm -hmm. Have seen any progress at all? Mm -hmm. um, uh, Hon Nam Hong uh, was quoted by Phnom Penh Post as saying that Cambodia will not withdraw from that uh, 4.6 uh, mm -hmm. uh, square kilometer area, mm -hmm. disputed area, and mm -hmm. Cambodia will have, will still let the World Court decide on that matter. Mm -hmm. so, and he said that if uh, the World Court said that the area belongs to Thailand. We are happy to give it back to Thailand. So <laughs> this is very, um, very logical, yeah. uh, matter of fact speaking. It's mm -hmm. not any concrete um, concession from the Cambodian side at mm -hmm. all. Mm -hmm. And also the uh, second, um, uh, second Army Region of Thailand also said the same thing today, that uh, the true withdrawal from the mm -hmm. area yeah. will not happen anytime soon. Ah, One thing that may uh, can be considered a progress is the uh, uh, observa uh, observers. Yeah, uh, uh, Indonesia uh, observers. Yes, uh, they both, uh, Thailand agreed to to the observation uh, program now. But uh, that was agreed upon even before you know, even before. Yes. So there was uh, nothing new. It was it, it it was a strong uh, a strong position from the Afghan government uh -huh. uh, until uh, just shortly before the election that we sought mm -hmm. to understand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So basically, Ying Lak did not get any real concession from Hun Sen. She got a very good um, a headline from the watching uh, from from the from Ben Post. Yeah. Uh, the headline above the story of her visit said that uh, relations back on track. Okay. That's uh, at okay. least uh, at least something to. It's a to good headline, but we need more than just headlines. Right. We need to see some real substantial agreement between Hun Sen and the new government because we believe that after having shown his friendliness, cordial relations with the new government, Hun Sen would have to produce something that mm -hmm. the Thai people and the Cambodian people for that matter mm -hmm. can really see, touch, and really can 
make very specific references right. to the new level of relationship. That is more important than the handshakes and the headlines.